I understand that. Um, this one, guys, brought to you by the folks at Regal Products. And uh, I am using the Regal Oats today. The, the oats really is a lovely substitute. If you're doing meatballs or meatloaf or any type of meat dish, if you want to keep it healthy, I'm keeping it in a kind of healthy theme today. If you want to keep it a little healthy, a little healthy twist, you replace breadcrumbs with some regal oats. And I'm using the instant oats here. Let me show you how easy it is to do. I'm also using, guys, I, I just kind of had some, some seeds, some sunflower seeds and some pumpkin seeds. Um, this will just garnish the top of my salad. So what I'm doing is very simple, Gary. I'm doing a lamb meatball salad. So I, 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 love, I love lamb. I love beef, I love meat, but, but lamb sometimes really just, I love the little wild okay. taste that lamb gives. So this is actually crushed lamb. You can use beef meatballs to do this, of course, but I have garlic comments here, so I try to do a little exotic and, you know, uh, you have to uh, share that. lamb meatballs, <laughs> lamb meatballs. So simple, I, I'm going to just start seasoning up mm -hmm, this, mm -hmm. so some salt, right, you season up, season, mm -hmm. season well, some pepper, and I will want to add some spice in it. So I have some cumin, you could add to that as well. I have some paprika. I love fresh herbs, so I have a little mixture of fine thyme as well as some rosemary okay. in here that I want to get all over there. And fresh garlic. Love fresh garlic. Mm -hmm. And I get my garlic in there. Mm -hmm. And I can start mixing this together. Little dutch of pepper. Are you a pepper, a pepper, a pepper mouth? Not so much. Not too much. So I'll, 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 I'll do slight fear. Yeah, I'll, do slight fear. Yeah. <laughs> I'll do slight fear. I'll do slight fear. If you have a pepper mouth, mm -hmm. I could add some pepper sauce to it as well as the binding ingredients that goes in now, which is really the eggs and the oh. breadcrumbs. Um, so you have you have an egg that you can just mm -hmm. do a light beat. I like to add half of the egg just because I don't want the mixture to be too wet. Right, if right, I right. need to add more, I will. So the egg is like the, the midfield in a football team. Egg it connects you, everything you together. Gotta come in, <laughs> come on. <laughs> <laughs> it, 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 it mm. connects. It, it connects, connects and brings everything, everything together. together yeah. Defense mm -hmm. and the and, and the attacking mm -hmm. midfield. Midfield. The eggs. <laughs> the eggs in <laughs> <of the> midfield. <laughs> and my meatballs. <laughs> Only garlic comments. <laughs> so I have my my oats that I'm using these oats instead of breadcrumbs, guys. So if you're looking to stay away from flour or bread, mm -hmm. these oats are the perfect healthy combination that you can just replace right. breadcrumbs with. Okay, right. And you add that in there and you mix. Another thing you could have done with the oats is soak it in some milk. It also gives it some nice texture as well um, with these meatballs. You could have added some milk, but you just have, gotta be careful now in terms of how much egg you add. If it is because the milk will be it will be a nice milky texture yeah, to, 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 to your oats. That, that, that could have worked well as well. But this is kind of what I'm looking for. And now I can start rolling out these balls. So to get even balls, yeah, right. uh -huh. <laughs> I measure, you know. Right. I kind of just do that. And literally the balls should just kind of come together nicely like that. So you want, well, I would say like golf size balls right. kind of thing. You don't want football no, here, no, right? no. You don't want a football, <laughs> beat ball, yeah. No, golf size mm. balls kind of thing. Not football and basketball. No. <laughs> you're overdoing the balls there, right? And you just keep rolling out. Very, very simple. Time for this to go into the oven and bake up for just about 20 minutes or so. And Gali, power of cooking on TV. Mm -hmm. I have some balls ready. Oh, okay. Ready to go. So you see, nice color mm. it gets there. Um, and these bowls, you can really just pop it and start to eat it just like that, you know. Mm -hmm. I can't bring Gary Cummins on the show and just have him eat meatballs right, 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 by right, itself right, right. like that. So what I'm doing, Gary, is I created a little salad. So you still your favorite greens, mm -hmm. lettuce, right. spinach. Mm -hmm. We have some lettuce and, and, and lovely tomatoes and some onions and that kind of thing. Nice base of salad. And I really just want to know Lay these balls. Just like that. And your favorite dressing. I love a creamy dressing. It's not always, sometimes you can use a vinaigrette, but I love a creamy dressing. And you just kind of, most important ingredient, keeping it healthy, is the regal oats. Replace your breadcrumbs with oats and you get a very, very healthy meatball. Kali comments. Please enjoy. Mm -hmm. Please enjoy. Thank you very much.
It's good. Delicious. So you go and tell Mrs. Cummings mm. <laughs> you want lamb meatballs <laughs> with regal with regal oats mm. instead of breadcrumbs. Just give me the recipe. Just give me the recipe, and you can get the recipe right on our YouTube channel, Cup of Joe Caribbean. Gali Cummings is here. We want to thank the folks at Regal for making this one possible. When we come back, we get into the heart and mind of this gentleman, <laughs> Everett Gali Cummings. His brand new autobiography is out and we find out all about this wonderful book that he has put together when we come back. Roll out a recipe with Regal Products.